Hello everyone and welcome back to another Specimen Saturday. And you guys probably recognize the adorable chubby cheeked little one who is featured in this Saturday's special. And that is because it is a squirrel. Look at him, isn't he so cute? The common squirrel, and he's going to look different depending on where you live in the world. Our squirrels around here are primarily gray squirrels, which means that they are pretty chubby. They have these white bellies and they have kind of a gray with some brown sort of spotting coat on the back. They've got the long tails, the adorable hands, and the perky little ears, and they are pretty well acclimated to human activity because they live around a big park. And these squirrels are just so much fun to watch because they're so used to humans, they'll often go through a lot of their natural behavior even when people are all around them. And I noticed this year that the squirrels here were doing something I had never seen before, and that is that they were actively building their nest up in the trees. And I had known ever since I was little that those big pile of leaves that you can see in some trees are called squirrel nests, but I had no idea how they really make a nest, and I was really confused about why the squirrels were actively building their nests around the lake when it's getting into winter. And it turns out these nests are called drays, D-R-E-Y, and the squirrels will build them during the coldest part of the year in order to climb inside and huddle together and keep their warmth in insulated inside of their little dray. And it's so much fun to watch and build it oh, just to like tear the leaves and tear the branches off of the trees and they'll insulate their dray crawl in on the cold nights and that's how they stay warm and get through the coldest part of the season these squirrels in particular were amazing because they were actively chewing living branches off of the tree around them and then going up and fitting them into place in their nest it was a really fantastic example of animal architecture and it was so much fun to watch and it was very different because i have also watched the squirrel off the back of our deck build up their very large impressive dray that is up in the tree right right behind our deck and she builds her nest very very differently because she will actually only gather up the dead leaves off of the floor of the forest and take them up to her dray instead of getting the living leaves and branches right around her dray so even in the humble squirrel and their yearly dray building there's so much to learn and i will see you guys next time Bye bye